Hello everybody, Hadrija here, and welcome back to more Tales of Arise. Last time, what we did last time, was uh, we, we defeated a Ganabeld, which is just a, a dumb name to have. Like, seriously, what, 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 kind, what, what kind of name is that? Yeah, and after that, uh, we did a couple of side quests, but most importantly, we are here in Vincent. And this place is the place run by a Renan Lord, but with, uh, you know, uh, Danon and, you know, Renan people, you know, just living around. Still see see people with uh, you know, the cores in their hands and whatnot. But, uh, speak with citizens of Vincent. That's what we have to do. So let's just talk to him. Uh, do you need anything? So what is this place? This is Vincent, the capital city of... Elding Menacea. Beautiful, verdant, peaceful city of full life. Most, most beautiful landmark is uh, Altalinia Palace, the manor of Lord uh, Dolhain. His policies have ensured that we can live our lives free of oppression. Do you need anything else? Uh, seems pretty bustling here. Sure is. So, what set the city apart? We're still technically slaves, but we get paid barely for our work. So everyone's happy to work. The marketplace is booming, and worries about where food or lodgings come from are a thing of the past. It's all of, all of the work of Lord Dolhim's uh, reforms. Now then, uh, you need anything else? Uh, is there anywhere we can rest? Ah, uh, you must be tired after so long on the road. Go up the stairs behind me, and you'll find an inn straight to your right. They've always got a bar to grow out front, so it, it should should be hard to miss. So with the feathers, what? what? Uh, oh, okay. Uh, the beds there are are great, so I highly recommend uh, staying there at least once. All right. Uh, thanks. Uh, so uh, there's someone down here. Talk to you. Oh. Okay, a running soldier talking to, you know, uh, Danon's sock. Your armor rocks, big guy. Let me wear it. <laughs> Our armor is certainly something even a Danon like you could wear. You just need to grow into it first. I'll work hard to grow big and strong then. Promise. So I guess you can kind of call this like the north if we're gonna like uh, kind of compare this to like real life where in the north you know like slaves were well here they're they're still technically slaves but they're being paid a good amount whereas I if I'm remembering my history right like oh hey uh, the slaves were free up in the north or like they were more free than they were than in the south. You know, at a certain time period, I don't remember the time period. It's, it, it's been a while since, <laughs> since since history class. So uh, sorry about that. Uh, so yeah, so this would be like kind of a mix of like New York with a mix of like India, kind of. Alright, so uh, here's the end. <sighs> yeah, I started recording Looks late, like late, late again. Over our heads. Just like last session, uh, yeah, homework is getting to me like, uh, it's just been difficult for me to do any work. Uh, so what do you have? Ooh, a happy bottle? Uh, okay, brings good luck when consumed, greatly increasing the battle chain bonus gauge. Okay, then that's pretty good. We get all of this. Uh, and I already have those. Okay. So, uh, don't need to do anything here. Uh, how about the smiths? Um, uh, don't need anything from you. How about you? Anything new from you? Uh, can't make that, but we can make the Thunder Nail. Uh, 
No, no. Okay, so let's make the thumbnail first new, more powerful weapon compared to you know the the, the weapon that we already had. All right, so uh, let's make it. There we go. I yeah. always love the sound of hammers banging away. And skin is still uh, on it, so yep. I, I I really love love how that weapon looks. All right, well, well, let's see tonight. We'll probably, you know, uh, get something, you know, my good skin, maybe. Uh, let's see here. Uh, I'll have Alfin do it. <clears throat> good. This came out just the way I hoped. All right, good. You know, kind of shame we don't get the choice of, oh, hey, let's try to make some bonds with, you know, the other characters, you know, while while we're resting at ends. So we could have that happen, you know, just just got put an option like, hey, uh, want to talk to someone? I wish it didn't just say, oh. Do you sense one of your friends, Hoodle? Oh, okay. Yeah, time, time shifts. Uh, but yeah, I, I do wish they, it's not just stuck with, uh, you know, uh, at campfires. Uh, so let's uh, talk to you. Hey, Garzman, shouldn't you be working? I don't know what it's like in, in the realm you come from, but here in Mencia, everything's peaceful. Is there a chance of anything bad happening? Well, yeah, thanks to the Lord. Life is nice for all of us. Yeah, see? There's more than just us anyway. There's also the Guardsmen. Nothing's gonna break if I slack off. Nonetheless, the reason this city is so peaceful is because you Renin soldiers are around. All the younger kids idolize you, so don't uh, shatter their illusions, please. You got a silver tongue, mister. Fine, I'll make this drink my last. Hmm. So, I wonder why, like, other areas, like, in this world, if if it's, you know, still like, uh, like, um, not like, you know, see this place and like, you know, kind of take inputs. Like, uh, ba back at home, uh, um, in, uh, Calaglia or like in Cislodia. I mean, Cislodia is like a, a bit different, like, you know, from, you know, uh, uh Calagli Calaglia, you know, but, uh, you know, with, with the, you know, Lord Gone from here, I guess it's gonna get better, but, uh, yeah, like, uh, how come nobody else is saying, oh, hey, uh, yeah, Kagli, um, um, fencing is so much better, we should, like, go there, you know? Okay, uh, it's close. Somewhere near here. Yeah, it's like somewhere in this direction. Oh, there you are. A halo. And... Maybe something's going on in the forest. Okay, uh, I, I did say uh, once we hit 15, I'll, I'll head to the forest, so uh, I'll, I'll do just that. Let's see what's happening uh, down the out forest. Oh yeah, I got God. Keep matching that Zephyr's dead. We we know, we know, game. Do you sense one of your friends, Hoodle? Hmm. Is there one hidden? <laughs> or are you just talking about these people, these owls? Because like owls are everywhere, unless like there's a hidden like one here so let's talk okay okay owl spotter sure so it's a nice getting some you know inventory items Ski. 
Excuse me? Oh, an apple gel. Okay, okay, okay. Ooh, a noble blossom. Old-fashioned dress armor made on bunges. Uh, it's a uh, vivacious flowery coloration makes it hugely popular among young Brennan women. Noble crimson. Okay. Uh, the passionate crimson that tinge it brings out its swear womanly charms in full force. Scarlet and hair coat. One. Uh, clothing passed down from generation to generation among a mage clan. Its fiery redness signifies its strength, strength and ferocity of the wearer's willpower. Blue coat. Uh, it's a vivid blue dye symbol, uh, symbolic of the wearer's profound tenderness. Look, it's all the owls we found. I guess this was their way of thanking us for finding them. It looks like they're grouping up by color. Is that a thing? Actually, the color of Dan and Owl's feathers is based on their maturity and their astral energy element. So maybe they stick to certain groups even if they all belong to the same kingdom. Then I guess that means we can tell just how many owls we found in each domain. <laughs> they seem to be saying something. Maybe they're thanking us for finding their buddies. <laughs> then again, maybe they're telling us that we have more owls to find. I think the Queen is protesting that they shouldn't put undue pressure on us. <laughs> Maybe he's arguing back that we're the only ones they can actually turn to? Right. Which is why the Queen is worried about sowing any ill will with us. Hoo! Hoo! We'll do our best, so don't worry, I think. Can you understand them? <laughs> of course not. I'm just inferring. For some reason, when I hear them talk, that's just what I imagine them saying. Oh, well, I think you're pretty close to the mark, at least. Well, don't worry about it. We're not breaking our backs over this. Oh. I think that was a thank you. Seems like it, from both of them. <laughs> Hoodle seems happy with this. Isn't that nice, Rinwell? Huh? Uh, oh, yeah. Absolutely. <sighs> let's cover more owls. <laughs> okay, uh, let's just see. Uh, is it caution? Uh, okay, not for me. So, uh, okay. Ooh, that is. Ooh. Ooh, I like that. Ooh. I mean, that's sexy, but like, ooh. Ooh. That, that is a nine. Mmm. 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 Eh, it's all right. Yeah, I, I like that, but I think probably the, the blue probably fits her a bit more. I don't know why I really like this, especially the little, like the, 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 uh, the talon claws. I, I, I like that. Uh, some. Um, I'll I'll put this on. Why not? Also, you. Uh. Yeah, but let's put that on. Uh, he has this. Uh. Yeah. Um, uh, uh, I'll keep that. I, I I like your hair like that. And uh, yeah, I think we're pretty much good on that. So let us get out out of here and talk to some more people. Try to get a bit more feeling of instinct.
Uh, so yeah, it's essentially like they they they're kind of free, kind of. Always good to be back in familiar territory. What? Whoa, whoa! Oh, there we go. The, the map glitched out a little bit there. <laughs> okay. Oh. Okay. I take it you folks are all travelers. It's so wonderful to have you all here. I guess. You really don't bat an eye at us all being together, do you? Even though we have a uh, Ren with us. Mm -hmm. Are you surprised? I suppose it might not be a common sight elsewhere on Dana, but here in Vincent, it's part of it's part of everyday life. Hey, if we want to build, build visit the palace, do we keep going this way? Sure. Yes, that's exactly right. Although, if you ask me, the training grounds might be more up your alley, since you all appear to be that of that persuasion. Training grounds, you could say? Is that code for some kind of arena where you may complete strangers fight and kill one another for sport? <laughs> no, absolutely not. It's nothing terrible like that. The training grounds are where they is what they sell like. It's true that years ago, it used to be a really gruesome place where slaves had to fight each other, as well as vicious zoogles. When our current lord, Lord Dolheim, came to power, one of the very first things he did was put a stop to such an awful spectacle. Hmm. You're telling me a Renan lord did that? The place was then refurnished and it reopened as a proper place to train like it's known for these days. <laughs> it's mainly designed to be used by the Elden Menacina Guard, but it's open to anyone who wishes to use its facilities. Hmm? Anyone? Even Danans? Sure. Of course. The arena is far too punishing for me, but if you're looking to hone your skills, I recommend you pay a visit. Okay. So we got a uh, we got four side quests on us. Uh, let's also uh, talk to whoever's down here. Uh, ooh, Gus, some pork. Did all these pe- did all those people move here? That says that people used to have to carry a lot of heavy and dangerous stuff. I don't know if I believe that. I can't imagine that kind of stuff ever happening here. Hmm. Innocence is bliss, I guess. I Right. Hear a voice. Somebody's asking for help. Hopefully, it's nothing that'll be too hard to no, deal god, with. No, it's him again. It's him again. Oh god. Uh, no, nah. We ain't falling for that trick. Nope. You see anybody around here who could use our help? We can't chase after every little thing. Oh boy, that that is a that's a fancy place. That's a fancy place. Uh, okay, so uh, one last person to talk to. Or why does she look like Elizabeth from uh, from uh, uh, Bioshock Infinite? <laughs> Curious about what I'm wearing? I bought this myself, if you'll believe it. Nowadays, we didn't get paid a fair wage to do the work we do. It's all thanks to Lord Doheny. I still can't believe I'm seeing Danans and Renans getting along. You never know. It could all be an act on orders from the Renans. To what end? It would be an incredible amount of effort just to fool us. Let's check out more of the city. There's probably places we haven't seen yet. Alright, so training grounds. Check this out. So I'm guessing this is where that DLC comes in. We've got a from the last session, uh, I, I said that I got a uh, train ground uh, uh, DLC for free. So, this is probably where we can use it. Okay, let's just check out Speedy. Uh, gonna keep on saving. So, these are the training grounds. The atmosphere here feels different compared to the rest of Vicent. It's just a nicer name for a place where people go to fight. 
So? It's still a good way for us to test our strength. Stop sweating the small stuff. All right, uh, let's try out at least. Uh, okay. Uh, let's try soul battle. Uh, three minutes. Huh. Recommend level 20. Uh. Okay, let's do this. The alpha training. Let's try to do this. Now, it says that the enemy only takes damage when once they're down. An opponent like this should be easy. You got the spirit. Shivering wind. Devastation. Rising Phoenix. I won't show you any mercy. Now you'll learn. You're going to hell. You're mine. Shivering wind. Devastation. Rising Phoenix. Take this. It's over. Okay, I'm trying to remember how to get down. Sword Alpha! Not today! You're mine! It's over! Strike! Demon Fang! Try harder! Here I come! It's over! Sword Rain Alpha! Demon Fang! Oh, so once they're down once, then I can just easily, like, just deal damage. And I know item though I didn't know that it would just continue to have this. Careful. Oh, uh, yeah, I, I really shouldn't be using this move. to down uh often because it's kind of hard to do that uh hmm hmm planning boost tax okay uh okay yeah, so I need to get more boost attacks and getting, you know, enemy weak points. But I, I, they don't have weak points as, as we can see because they're not, you know, uh, they like, well, we, we couldn't see any uh, weak points. So, so, anyways, let's just try to uh, continue on. Let's try to find the best, find the way to the palace, I think. That's what we need to do, right? Uh, 
Well, I'm, I have a feeling that, like, uh, we're not gonna see Dolan in the castle, like, right away. I feel like this, they're gonna see. My dad's working in the quarry today. So is mine. I'm gonna help him when I grow up. I feel like they're gonna say, like oh, hey, uh, in the quarry. let's go check it out. Like, oh, yeah, he, he's out, out, out and about. So, well, let's just check the, this, the skip real quick. Downloaded. So, do any of you know anything about Lord Dohalim? I think I remember hearing something back in Cislodan about how he fights using a rod. A rod? I don't know the details, but from what I gather, he swings a long rod around and uses it to stab and smack people from afar. I think there's also something he does with, like, trees or grass or something? I forget. Grass? Bear in mind that Elda Menencia harvests Earth astral energy. It would be no surprise for him to have some sort of control over plants. So basically the point is we know nothing about the guy. Wish we weren't going in completely blind. Okay. Hmm. Got two. Oh, uh, we can go over here. Uh. Oh, hello, mushrooms. Uh, we can't go past this one, can we? Yelling woods. The outside patrol area and safe to stay away. Uh, and we're warriors. We, we can deal with that kind of stuff. Don't gotta worry about us. Uh, can we go past here? It's in quarry. We freely visit, but don't fall in. Oh, the grinder. Oh, no, no, no. Don't wanna fall into that. And let's see what this is all about. Stay sharp. We're going in. Hmm. Okay. So I'm guessing this is their, uh, where, where they really work. This is I'm sorry. Whole... I'm not feeling well today. Could I please take the day off? Oh, that's terrible. Uh, rest up and try not to strain yourself. I'll let the others know. Thank you. I appreciate it. Wow. Ooh. Now we're where I thought I was going to go. But not going to lie. This area, this sounds like, yep. People can do what they want. But yeah, that's pretty cool. Jump. Yeah, jump off. Alright, so just gonna grab all this stuff here. Hope you guys don't mind. So, well, what are you guys mining for? Like, I mean, this place looks like it's, like, barely built to, you know, kind of last, you know, with these, you know, kind of, like, square, rectangular, like, you know, walls and whatnot. You guys really want to, you know, continue on going through here? Everybody seems so happy working here. And it seems like the soldiers are there to actually protect them rather than keep an eye on them. I don't get it. How can it be like this? I mean, you have a good leader that'll make people happy. You'll probably get people to have working people like this. I'm pretty sure that how it, that's how it works, right? Happy leader, happy people. But, uh, yeah. See what's going on here. Guessing this is where we're, we're gonna find a Dohim, maybe? Halt! Oh, hello! Hello, hello, hello! I presume you're Alfin of Orbis Calaglia? I'm Captain Kisara of the Elder Menencia Guard. Just Kisara? No last name would make you a Danon. So it does. Is that a problem? The guard. Wait, so you're saying the Lord of Elda Menencia has Danons protecting him? In this country, Danon guardsmen aren't unusual. Everyone who enlists does so of their own free will. She sounds like she's serious, Alfin. That makes no sense. Don't your people remember seven years ago? Wouldn't you be grateful if you were finally allowed to live as a free person? And for my part, 
There is no greater honor than being chosen to serve His Excellency, Lord Dohalim. I feel no shame. <laughs> but all of that aside, I came seeking you, Alfin, at Lord Dohalim's behest. He wishes an audience with you. W with us? Indeed. He awaits you at Ottolina Palace. That is, if you choose to accept. Ottolina. I am here only as a messenger, not a kidnapper. Your reply? All right. We'll meet your lord. Very well. I shall return and deliver your acceptance. Please don't keep him waiting too long. Ooh, girl. You know, ooh, ooh. What lies beyond this point? A quarry manned by Dan and laborers. Nothing else? There's a Danon medical facility for the severely ill at the back. However, for sanitation reasons, it's kept off limits, ooh, even to ooh, guardsmen. Ooh, that, ooh. that was odd. Why do you think this Doalim would want to see us? It's probably a trap. Still, they already know we're here. Not like we can start being stealthy now. We might as well listen to what he has to say. Hey, are you sure about going? What if it's a trap? That's no reason to back out now. Law's right. I get your concern, but we should buckle down. Bruh. Bruh, Kisar. Kisar at the booty. Booty. I will Kisar that ass. <laughs> uh, but anyways. Hmm. I wonder what's behind here. I bet that's just like a deep, dark secret. Just like... Yes, they, we do have pretty bad people, uh, like, uh, like this, this town secret, like, yep, 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 and then we, 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 we have slave, slave dance who are really bad, you know, like, poorly kept, you know, what not. I bet, like, it's that kind of secret there, behind that door. I mean, we could ask people, oh, hey, have you seen people who've gone there and never gone up yet? Is the palace. You think it's dangerous to go inside? It's not a question of danger. We're going inside regardless. Okay, I want to check I here. If something happened. Cause you haven't checked this out. Oh, nope. Can't even check it out. So oh, great. You know, I sure you. I should have checked that out before even like you know heading heading into the quarry. Let's see what's going on around here. Yeah. There might be someone who could use our help. All right, into the palace. Hello, Kisara. Hey. You again? Oh, you again. After we parted ways, an urgent uh, petition from the citizenry uh, came in. Lord Dohim is currently busy, uh, is current busy report responding to it. As such, I must ask you to wait until he's, until he finishes business. Once preparations are complete, I'll lead the way. Okay. So now, oh, there we go. Pretty fancy place they got here. There's no way this isn't a trap. Your guests, my lord. Thank you, Kisara. You're the wielder of the blazing sword. The liberator of Calaglia. You do dress humbly for someone of such grandeur. But where are my manners? I am the ruler of Elda Menencia. I'm Lord Dohilim Ilkaris. If you know who we are, then you know how strange it is to invite us into your palace. I thought I'd clear up your misconceptions before things could escalate. What do you say? <sighs> You did come here to defeat me, did you not? Perhaps, and what if we did? Are you planning to fight us here? I don't think that will be necessary. 
After all, I imagine you've taken in a fair amount of his scent by this point. Have you come across even one slave being abused? Soldiers killing for sport? Suffering of any form? I mean, there's that door. I would hazard that you have not. For I have liberated Menencia from its suffering and brought joy to its people. But if these results are not enough to stay your sword... Yo, whoa, whoa, hold on there. I commend you for your boldness, but it won't work on me. Still, your would-be assassination cannot go unpunished. Elfin! <laughs> Fair enough. <laughs> Allow me to host you for dinner. We shall continue our talk then. Kelzalik? Yes, my lord. Please escort our guests if you would be so kind. As you wish, sire. Bruh. Uh, Elon should have done that. She 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 jumped the gun. Both literally and and metaphorically. What did you get for being so careless. What I get? What were you thinking, attacking him on your own? What are you upset about? Our whole goal is supposed to be overthrowing the lords. Remember, well, he's not doing anything. Hurt. And it wouldn't have been the first time either. What's gotten into you? <sighs> they, they, he's overthrowing the lords who are like, you know, evil. But Do you know that Alfin is really just worried about you, right? Yeah, yeah. Okay, there is overthrowing the lords. You are actually evil you know actually evil you're doing some evil stuff right like with the last two you know but then there's dolim who actually made the city right and then you're just like you know what? screw it i'm just gonna attack because we need, we need that massacre and whatnot no no that's the, no you saw how like he was just talking him the whole right through right just like you could just say hey uh give me the, the massacre if you have it you know just like no like she don't just jump the gun like way too quickly. He's worried. I mean, that's what it looked like to me. Uh, but um, maybe not. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Definitely lose cannon. All right. Oh, Lord A G. Uh, lunar corruption slides and fires into the ground, causing an explosion that causes the enemy into... Oh, okay, that's pretty good. Uh, I might get both of these right now. Easier overwhelm with lunar corruption. Yeah, those sounds really good. Oh, uh, she, she shouldn't have done that, like, at all. That was just messed up. It pains me to see that Renan cuisine isn't to your liking. I asked my chefs to prepare only the finest delicacies available. Two wasted opportunities. Why did you set the Danans here free when you took over? Ah, uh, but you are mistaken. You see, I may rule single-handedly. But on my own, even I cannot change the order of things. But what is within my power is the welfare of the people. The fostering of a mutual respect among the classes. This I can change. Sounds a lot like the Danins are still oppressed, if you ask me. Only in the sense they continue to serve as laborers, yes. However, I assure you they are fairly compensated for their efforts. This harmony we strive for is the current pinnacle of Ren and Danin coexistence. Harmony and coexistence between the Renans and the Danans. What about the crown contest? This doesn't exactly make you a shoe in And yet, the Danans here are even more productive than when they used to face daily lashings. In any case, the crown contest is of little importance to me, and even less to Elda Menencia. You see, I have no interest in becoming sovereign. <laughs> Oh, oh, okay.
Okay, well, what's this all about? This is some mocap stuff. Stop this. Please, it's over. Stop. You're blaming him on what happened to the other guy, even though that guy was what it seems to was like seems to one being provoking Dolahim. He Dolahim saying for him to stop. Didn't stop. Okay. Somehow use uh the bow staff staff whatever to like attack and somehow kill it somehow has a, 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 an edge even though it's just a round blunt object uh, okay <laughs> shouldn't be you, were you here this entire time <gasps> like was there not other people here or what It is not by choice that one assumes the throne of a realm. But Sovereign is a different matter entirely. I have no interest in playing their game. Are you saying you'll withdraw from the contest? I guess if you don't plan to ascend the throne, there's not much reason to harvest energy from Danans, is there? Let the ambitious fight it out amongst themselves. All I care for is maintaining peace throughout my realm. So what? Your personal desires are all that matter to you? Take a look in the mirror. I may not play their games, but you have outright betrayed your own. You've torn down two of my fellow lords. What precisely is your aim? <sighs> Spare me your answer. I care not for your reasons. Suffice it to say, I will not impede you. That said, should you threaten the peace of my realm, I will respond. I suggest you conclude your business and leave Menencia at your earliest convenience. Kelzalik! Our guests depart. Please see to their lodgings for the night. I shall arrange for rooms for you all at a local inn. It is a short ways down the road. You may stay there for the night, after which I suggest you promptly make your departure. You know, that's, you know, the most civil time, the most civil talking with the Lord we've had so far. Damn, look at how ritzy this place is. How many rooms do you think it's got? Don't you think you're being a little too relaxed? They could strike at any moment. If they were going to attack us, they would have done it already. Huh. Yeah, I really wish, really wish Yon didn't just pull the trigger like that. Like we we could have you know a better you know time talking to him, you know instead of like just like oh yep he's just angry that you did it. But, oh well, guess we're leaving this place. Maybe. 
Hopefully there is an unlocked door, maybe. Lord's Court. Ah. Is there any treasure here I can take at least, you know? One tiny little bit of treasure, maybe? Come on, there has to be something here that's not locked. Oh, here, oh. The entrance closet. Uh, please let me, let me go back. Mm, no. And now, yeah, it's. Oh, hello. Ooh. It's gonna save. Yeah, I, 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 I do like like this. I do like the the changing of you know the menu here. You know, it, it really keeps you on your toes, you know, about you know oh every time you go into the menu, you never know what might show up. Uh, not going down to the first floor just yet. I still want to explore, explore here. A uh, little lagging, a little drop frames happen, happen there. A meeting room, meeting room. Oh, here we go. I want my demos. So this is considered the meeting room. Oh, okay. It's more like a resting room, if you ask me. Uh, everyone's just tired. It, it, it should really be called called a resting room instead of a meeting room. Like you think like a meeting room is just you know kind of like you know a conference room, you know. But nope. Okay. Continue on through here. Have quarters. Maybe we'll get Siki Star here. Uh huh. Huh? Okay, nothing else is here. Okay, what about the other rooms? Oh, that's back to the entrance plaza. Uh, okay, the barracks. Yeah, the other room should be called barracks. The, the meeting room should be called the barracks. Or, like, or at least, you know, barracks number two. Or number one, whichever came first. Dang, these are like pretty huge beds. Not gonna lie, there are like two people in there. Oh man, uh, I wish I had a, a little bigger bed. Uh, okay, uh, I think we've already went to the. Uh, I'm not sure we did. Like we we went through the bottom. Yep. Yeah, I I I think we did. Uh, did we? What I pretty pretty sure they're locked. Pretty sure. Yeah, they're locked. Oh no, no, not the guards room. So we didn't come through here. Hello, Kisara. Ooh, ooh. Ooh, pork bun recipe. Hello, Kisara. Bro, come on. Oh god, come on.
All right. Yep. Keystar. Girl. Girl, what is your workout? How, how to get how do you get a mighty fine booty like that? <laughs> like 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 we with <laughs> you you know you know the designers like we gotta make her with a great butt. <laughs> we, we every time we see her, gotta make sure that we have the buttons inside. <laughs> like in the opening, just like just had, just had a shot right on her butt. <laughs> Uh, but yeah, we, we, we got to get out of here. We're gonna have to stay at the end for the night. And we're leaving this place. Cause thanks, thanks, Shion, for jumping the gun and whatnot. Oh, hello. Ah, uh, come on. How can I jump go? What is? I mean, this is the first floor, so. Uh, okay, let's head over to the left here. Oh, uh, a lot of this place is explorable. Ooh, okay, yeah. Well, let's start with the outer part and then work our way in. Okay. So we've got the kitchen. Go and get some food, some ingredients. Because we need them. We need all the food that we can get. Do you sense one of Ooh. your friends, Hoodle? Oh, there we go. Crown. <laughs> Look, Hoodle. One of your buddies. Tomato. Lemon. Beef. What's this thing? Beef. You know, beef struggling sugar knocks. And whatnot. Okay. Guessing that's all for this for the kitchen. Okay, uh, that's an entrance. Staff waiting room. What's the staff waiting on? Waiting for their ship to start or something like that? Oh, what's up with all the peach gels? Like, I, I want them. I wish there wasn't like a limit of 15. I really wish there wasn't. Just let me stock up on like 99 of them, then we're good, you know. You, know, you, you can never have enough healing items, you know. You can never have enough healing items. That's like that's like one of the first rules of like uh, like JRPGs and whatnot, or like games in, in general. You can never have too many items. You know, was max up on, on like 99, you know. Not 999, no, that, that, that's a bit too much, but, you know, just having 99, I think that, that, that that's, like, I think all right. Hungry. Funny. I could have sworn that was your stomach making all the racket. <laughs> Whoa. What is this place? The shelves here are filled with books. Not just Renin books either. There are tons of Danon ones too. Rinwell, I get that you're excited, but we've got more important things to worry about right now. Y yeah, you're right. Sorry. Has she never been to a library before? Oh, an omelet. I, I, I guess she hasn't. Like, ooh, what is this place? Ooh, books. Okay, uh, let's just see here. 2,451 days left. 2,450 days left. The diary of an, of Renan who counted down the days to the crown contest. Okay. Uh, what's this? Curious and you finding gems in the rough. 
Okay. Astral Arts for winning for winners. Your surefire guide to claiming a lordship. Packed with Renan and Ledger. For some reason, they're all Renan and Danan. Okay. An illustrated guide to Zoogles, raising and breeding. Oh, Danan Customs. Oh, on? Or is it O? Oh, on Danan Customs, okay. Uh, let's see here. Anything hidden? No. Practical ash Astral Arts. Theories and Applications. Chrono the uh, chronology Chronology of the Crown Contest. The Sormans ship book with a slash cover. Did the reader get mad at the book or use it in the fight? I don't know, maybe. Perhaps. Maybe both. An introduction to the governments of uh, Lengis. The fire, the joy, the joys of fine liquor. A compendium of Menan Menansian breweries. That all? No. Not yet. Fashionista's Guide to uh, Lenches Attire and Armor. Use a thick astral energy research tome. So, uh, so hard to read, uh, they can put you to sleep. Uh, books about the art of torture. Were these black spot splotches on the cover? Uh, working slaves to the bone while maintaining productivity. Uh, should you get rid of that? Maybe, perhaps. Uh, yep, that's all the books that we could check out. Uh, okay, uh, any of the hidden items I'd kind of miss? Nope, okay. Come on. Get out of here. We don't wanna run we don't wanna read no stinking books. Books rot your brains. They give you the wrong information. Okay, uh not seeing much else here. Just got the storeroom. And that's about it for this area. We can, uh, well, the outer area. Check the innermost areas here. Just see, if, you know, just get any items. I think I saw a oh, couple there when we first entered. A uh, heavy treat. Nice. Okay. Anything else here? To the second store room. Storage room, store room, whichever. Alright, grab this. What's Andrew this Gold. And a happy bottle. Nice. Uh, I guess that's it for this area. Okay. Okay. Let's just check the middle area. Oh, uh, yeah, and the, the getting some, uh, some raindrops here. Got an egg. Yep, yep, yep. Brain drop is a bit noticeable here. Uh, I think happening over here. No, okay. In here, no. Saw an item over here. Yes, an apple. Well, it keeps the doctor away, I guess. Uh, okay. Uh, 
Alright, uh, let's just get out of here then. Check out basically everything that we can. Couldn't get into the locked areas, so... Yep, time to head to the inn. Yep, time to go. Do you really think we should trust accommodations from a Renan Lord? How do we know it's safe? Like we have any other choice. We can't go and set up camp outside of town at this hour. Honestly, I'd still take that over staying here. What if they try to kill us in our sleep? I doubt that's the case. His best chance to kill us would have been back at the palace. His true intentions aside, for now at least we're in his good books. Then we probably shouldn't test his patience. Let's find that in and check in. Uh, okay. Up to the end. Yeah, uh, I, I wonder what's the, the like, the twist, you know, like, I talked about earlier, like, about the, the whole, the whole close-off area in the, in the quarry, I feel like that might be brought up, but just, you know, how will Kisar and, you know, Dolin join our party? That's the real thing, I, I don't really know how they will, like, you know, with their whole, like, you know, kind of serious thing, uh, you know, leading this place. And what the heck is this rat doing? I mean, is that a rat? Like... What? Why? Why is this... Is this supposed to be a reference or something? Like... Just like, the rat just, you know... Fixing its nose, whiskers, whatnot, and the cat right behind it. Is this supposed to be like a Tom Jerry thing? I don't know. Maybe? Welcome, fair travelers. Lord Dohalim's retainer told us to expect you. It is an honor for you to stay with us. Please, make yourselves comfortable. This is better than I expected. <clears throat> the room. It's nice. Huh? Oh, uh, yeah. It is pretty nice. You okay, Law? You're a million miles away. Nah, it's weird. I felt strange ever since we arrived here. Can't seem to shake it. Maybe it's something about this place. You're just tired. I'm feeling pretty sluggish myself. Oh no, they drugged us. Seriously, you two? They a drugged the us. Our work here is far from over. Get yourselves together. I'm sorry, but I need to call it a day. Well, let's meet back here tomorrow morning and see where things go from there. Sound good? Sure, but keep an eye out for anything strange, okay? We still don't know how safe this place really is. Please don't tell me they drugged us. Are you two feeling any better? Yeah, a good night's sleep seems to have done the trick. I wonder why we felt so out of it. You think it might have been because of all the food we ate? You don't think they slipped something into our food, do you? That must be it. If they were making an attempt on our lives, we'd know it by now. Though, on the other hand, they could be warning us off. Come to think of it, you didn't eat anything at the meal, Rinwell. Aren't you starving? Oh, I made myself something later. You missed out. That was some mighty fancy grub they served yesterday. What? And give the enemy a chance to poison me too? Are you crazy? What's the big deal? Shion ate it too, remember? And we both tried the same stuff. 
Well, maybe they laced it with poison that's only harmful to Danins, hmm? That's enough, Rinwell. <sighs> A cat? Where'd it come from? There's something on its collar. Hold on a sec. I think it's trying to lead us somewhere. I'm gonna follow it. Uh, hey! Where do you think you're going? Okay, following the black cat. Oh, oh come on. No, I was about to say, uh, don't make me walk all the way there. Wow. Wow. Uh, there it is. Stay close. We're gonna lose it. What's gotten into you, Law? This might be the lead we've been waiting for. Seriously? Yeah. Some people train animals to act as messengers. They don't attract attention, see? And you think that someone might be using that cat? To reach out and send us a message or something? I could be wrong, but it's possible. I'm impressed. I would never have thought of that. I should know. We used to use them in Cislodia. She's so adorable. You say something? Don't tell me. Oh, okay. It's leaning down over here. I was like, please don't tell me he's going to get to the quarry. Oh, let's just grab these mushrooms before. Okay. Wait, what? Oh, thought the cat was there. Uh, oh, okay. So now we can get down here. Where do you think it's trying to lead us? Who knows? We should hurry. We don't want to lose it. Whoever came up with this is pretty damn clever. Yeah, it just looks like an ordinary cute cat. All right. 